Today, we are going to Publix. We need a few things, and for a while now, we've said we need to film a full video of what Publix is like for those of you that aren't in Florida or don't know what Publix is. Um, obviously, in our other videos, we've kind of shown bits and pieces of Publix. It's a grocery store. but We'll just go in, do kind of a tour of what all they have. So if you are out of state or you're moving here and you just don't know what Publix is, you can kind of have an idea of what those grocery stores are like. It'll also tie into when we got sushi and when we got a pub sub. Now it's time to film the whole thing. Let's go check it out. All right, we are heading in. You can see Publix, food and pharmacy. Looks like you can get some propane for your grill out in front. We do have some of these reusable Publix bags. They're actually really handy. Some outdoor seating. And then here's their hours. Looks like Monday through Saturday, 7 a.m. to 10 p.m., Sunday, 7 a.m. to 9 p.m., and there's some of their pharmacy hours. And if we enter here, to the left is, excuse me, where you can get your cart, which is what we're gonna do. This one is not one that is as updated as other ones. We went to one in Apopka, and it had, it was more updated than this one. This is like an older looking Publix. You're looking at some flowers. They have really good deals on flowers. I don't know. Do they have the deal right now? Yeah, it just depends on the types of flowers. But they're, these ones are usually three for 12. But I don't yeah. see. Oh, yeah, three for 12. So, got some good flowers. They also have a lottery here that you can buy, like, scratchers and stuff. However, it is cash only. You could not use a card. It's cash only only here you go here's a big thing three for 12 got some balloons there's restrooms right there then the bakery section most Publix are the same it's just some are newer than others like I said this is kind of like an older one the newer ones are like where we got the uh, pub sub at in um, Apopka and then right over here though they normally have pretty good deals. So like buy one, get one free, buy one, get one free. All these are buy one, get one free. So if you're looking for a deal up front, it's where it's at. Over in the bakery section, they've got some cheesecake, some different cakes. I will say one of our favorite dessert items, their cookies. They have amazing chocolate chip cookies right here. Even the uh, uh, sugar cookies are good. And then it's seasonal. Are they break? Yep. Lemon cookies. Lemon cookies. Top notch. And then it's like they've got some donuts over there, some turnovers. I didn't realize they had this, but they have a whole pack of lemon poppy seed muffins. So those are coming home with us, definitely. Now over on this wall, kind of all over the place in here, but over on this wall, they've got some of their bread. I know some people have commented that they love uh, public sourdough bread. Oh, pizza dough. Wow. I didn't know that. And then over here, you can do pickup orders as well as order like sliced cheese and meat. Of course, they have boar's head, which is very good. But you can also find pre-cut boar's head right here. But if we just keep walking down, you have your pub subs right there. You have your like soup salad bar. You have some other, like, food items you can get. There's your rotisserie chicken over there. And then all your produce down here. They do have a really good produce section. Side note, their um, brewed iced tea with ginseng and honey. Very good. Would recommend it. Now, a lot of times you'll see buy one, get one free. So right here they have buy one, get one free on the blackberries. Something else I really like is kids may enjoy one free piece of fruit from this bin as a healthy snack. Although that apple doesn't look <laughs> too, too good, but kid can get a free snack. And they've got their salads, vegetables. Kind of doing just a little walking tour. 
juices. I absolutely love cotton candy grapes. If you've never tried them, you totally should. They are very good. I love them. They're, they're very good. During strawberry season, they have some pretty good looking strawberries. And then we got some raspberries, blueberries, blackberries. Here's like their nut section. And then we're just gonna head down this way. So here's one of the videos we did, sushi. You can see here's their sushi station and then also their seafood. And then if we go down this aisle, this is their international foods, which we absolutely love this aisle to look at all the different items they have. Um, just to show you some, there's like your yum yum sauce. But I absolutely love Ribena. And if you've had Ribena before, comment below. Tell us if you like it, because it's very good. Some other things, Turkish delights, uh, ooh, original custard, the bird's custard. F fruit pastels, good. Maltesers, All right. and, uh, got Jacob's cream crackers, yeah. Digestives, hobnobs. I am gonna get some digestives. Are you a digestives person or a hobnobs? You're digestives, right? I like the dark chocolate. Yeah good items there some canned goods that's I guess we're in aisle two aisle three if there's certain things we're not getting in the aisles we'll probably just kind of go pretty quick but it's gonna be your pasta your soups your mac and cheese somebody is not happy your ramen and then your tuna down here at the end. And then we're right next to the seafood. Aisle four. Ooh, Oreos. We actually, we absolutely love these Oreo thins. They're good. What's your favorite type of Oreo? There's a lot to choose from. Gluten-free are very good. Yeah, gluten-free are good. I just love the consistency of these. So cookies, crackers, some school supplies or office supplies. Candy. Hey, look, Mario Kart. That's fun. And then now we're gonna go on to aisle five. See, that's where we came in right up front there. Here's your spices, your olive oils, dressings, cake mixes, sauces. I could stand right here all day and look at these sauces. Kind of going a little fast just because some of these aisles we don't need anything in this takes us out to the meat so they kind of have like meals that are already prepped for you and then your meats all down this section aisle six we've got our breakfast aisle so some cereals breakfast bars oatmeal syrup coffee I also like looking at all the different types of cereal. There's so many cereals. Pretty interesting stuff. And then at the very end, there's tea. Gonna be heading over to aisle seven. Aisle seven. Dog treats, dog food, light bulbs. You had a you had good point. You said with the app, because they have an app. If you select your location and then you add like your shopping list of things that you're gonna get, it'll tell you which aisle it's in and like create it in a list for you. Yeah, that's very handy. <laughs> cat litter, dry cat food, dog toys, beds. And then still out in front of us are more of the meats. And then if we look down, Aisle eight, it's gonna be your paper products. So paper towels, toilet paper, paper plates. I think we're about, about halfway done, I think. Here are the places you can check out. They've got some self checkout. Aisle nine, ooh, your detergents, air fresheners, cleaning products. Just kind of zoom through this one. We don't need anything down here take us to aisle 10 
Again, here's your meat. So I've got some bread setting out here, but aisle 10 is going to be, actually, I'm not gonna go down aisle 10, I'll just show you. So it's like your cards, your bags, magazines, diapers. I'm gonna skip aisle 10 because we don't need anything down there either. They do have some Bibles in here. Aisle 11, juices, breads. Some snacks, applesauce, some breads, lots of bread, juices, jams, peanut butter, some more drinks. All right, aisle 12, waters, wines on this side, lots of wine. Stella Rosa is one of our favorite wines especially the different flavors they have. Watermelon's very good. Some more water and wine. We usually get like these big packs of water for our house. There we go, there's some Stella right there. Blackberry, Blackberry was very good last time I got it. Man, they're going up in price. Where's Black Cherry at? Oh, yeah. All the flavors, there's watermelon. I liked blackberry a lot. It was good. Now we are heading over to cold cuts, breakfast meat, and then also frozen aisle. Frozen meats, entrees, pizzas. Got pretty good selection of pizzas here. Snacks, seafood. We do like these Amy's bowls for lunches, they're good. Potatoes, dinners, dinners. Now we're gonna be aisle 14. So we're circling around here, they got some ice cream and it looks like this is gonna be your frozen breakfast and your ice cream. We are unable to find breakfast pizzas. They used to have Red Baron breakfast pizza anywhere and now we can't find it and it's so good wish we could find it again lots of flavors of ice cream some bread novelties fruit biscuits and dessert and then this will bring us right over to the cheese love cheese then eggs there's fresh eggs right there Aisle 15 is like your snacks. So popcorn, chips. Oh, wow. <laughs> Pringles, cold beer, charcoal. There's charcoal down there. And then we can kind of crank out some more. So 16 feminine products, vitamins, potato chips down this aisle. 17 deodorant, beauty care snacks, and also some drinks. 18 hair care soft drinks. Yep, milk down there at the end. And then that brings us to 19. Our butter, some more drinks, some yogurt, and then there's milk down here at the end. creamers. I think that pretty much wraps it up. It looks like there's up in the front there of 19 some bath soap, cosmetics, to shoe care, things like that. I think we got everything we need. Oh, they got a travel section. Yeah, I didn't know that either. I think we have everything we need. So here's the pharmacy back over here. And then there's just some like, um, like medicines and stuff up here. This one does not have an upstairs, so it is like more of an outdated one, but some of them have upstairs. I think in the uh, pub sub video, I showed that advice. I showed that they have an upstairs, but now we're just going to go up here and check out. All right. And then that was, that was that. It said we saved $30 from doing some of the buy one, get ones. So that's good. Now we're back outside. There's some pots out here. Also, I want to 
make note that don't forget to put in your rewards if you're if you signed up for their like little rewards thing because it does help sometimes you get like the last time we got two dollars off so that was good and get the app because they send you little deals and stuff too yes they do send you deals um but anyway we're gonna have to unload this so that was a tour of public sorry if it was all over the place don't want to really film people shopping but tried to just show you around what a generic Publix looks like here in Florida. With that being said, that does it for today. Thanks for watching.